everyone is coward in this world but if you think there are many coward people then i would say they probably didn't get an opportunity or situation to show their courage yes that's true despair gives courage to a coward Welcome to my channel Dushi Mike. If you're new to Dushi Mike, consider subscribing my channel for more videos on English proverb we explain the stories and other general information. Do check my playlist. Now let's quickly jump into today's proverb of the episode. Yes, despair gives courage to the coward. Once there was a centipede that lived in a tree by the side of a pond. He was very timid and scared of even the slightest disturbance in the tree. One day a heavy wind blew across the tree and the centipede fell into the pond and was struggling to swim and stay afloat. A parrot that lived in the same tree broke a twig of the tree and threw it to the centipede. The centipede got onto the twig and the parrot swooped down, picked up the twig and placed it back on the tree. The Centipede thanked the parrot profusely for saving his life. As the days went by, the centipede and the parrot became good friends. The parrot always told the centipede that he should learn to be a bit braver and face life boldly. But the centipede remained the same. One day a hunter came to the pond to quench his thirst. As he was drinking water from the pond, he noticed a parrot sitting on the tree. The hunter wanted to shoot the parrot and got his bow and arrow ready. The centipede noticed this and wanted to desperately save his friend. The parrot was fast asleep and there was no one to warn him since he was sitting a long way from the centipede. The centipede knew that it did not have much time and it had to act fast. In desperation, the centipede jumped down from the tree and crawled as fast as he could and bit the toe of the hunter as hard as he could. The hunter cried out in pain and missed his aim. The parrot woke up hearing the noise and noticed the hunter with his bow and arrow. It flew away to safety. The centipede was very happy that it could save his friend and felt elated. for having acted bravely for once in his life hey friends i hope you like the story of the centipede and the parrot the story clearly illustrates that when the centipede was in a desperate situation he acted brave enough to save his friend parrot so that is what is all about So when someone is put in a desperate situation even a coward will turn into a warrior. Yes, at this note I would like to share a personal experience um which is with respect to this proverb. So it is the story of one of my friends named Ria. So she was very passionate about riding a two wheeler. But unfortunately she didn't have one. and she didn't have anyone to train but uh, her interest and love to learn driving to learn riding somehow she managed and bought a second hand to me so this was a story or a scenario about 15 to 20 years back when there were no school to train to wheelers so uh, her regular routine was as such that after her work every evening she used to take out her two wheeler and practice it so she was aware of a uh, riding bicycle which helped her in balancing and other stuff so she used to always take it uh, to the nearby park or nearby ground and the surrounding streets from her home but she was very afraid and she didn't have the courage to take it to the main road or go to the crowded places so the twist in the story lies here one fine day one of her best friends 
had come from states to visit her so they both had a very good time they took their two wheeler out and they went for a very long ride all of a sudden her friend got a, got an emergency call and she had to abruptly leave her in the middle of a crowded place now ria was all in shock frightened in the middle of the road so it was like a do or die situation for her but you know what ria did she chanted all the names of the god and goddesses she knew and then gained the courage and somehow managed to reach home safe in between she faced a lot of lots and lots of hindrances yelling and shouting from fellow riders big vehicle and small vehicle lots of abuses but she ignored everything and safely reached home without any injury that is why i quoted in the beginning of this video that there is no one in this world who we could tag them as coward okay so situation can change anyone even if you find or see a a person drowning in the water he would in order to save his life would catch hold of anything that comes on his way dear friends do let me know in the comment section below if you had faced any such situation similar situation or any situation where you instantly turned into a brave warrior all right okay thank you so much for your time friends happy learning this is the shanti signing off thank you bye bye